so guys uh, just uh, started uh, out and uh, it is 7 30 actually uh, miracle i thought of going out to be jaldi 6 30 but for some strange reason there was so much fog today in hyderabad generally never happens like that so now the fog has uh, subsided quite a bit little bit at the further but so just uh, came out and in fact could post the video for the last two days uh, here are the quick snippets what was happening to give you an idea and we'll be roaming around the high-tech city area today and we'll do some chit chat i wanted to take out the bike but i have to take the car actually arun from track and tech uh, came to hyderabad so i'm just going there and he came with his team members so obviously i can't take a bike because they won't fit so just going and as you can see i just don't like driving that much because of the traffic so anyways ciao uh, i'll try to make a review of this uh, car later on uh, so guys uh, here is arun from track and tech he was in hyderabad yes. and you had a little bit of biryani not yeah, yeah oris i think oris, oris biryani uh, leke aaye hum log oris we had it up upar wow man nice. really good i mean bahut maza aaya so hai. like after a long time he came to hyderabad so nice pandemic ke baad mein so literally... but this is going on my new vlog channel the हो चुके and uh, just working that's why no videos hopefully a day after tomorrow i can post a video I want to desperately go for a ride and finally i finished the video on the lenovo legion 5 pro i'll be posting this video on saturday looks like an update uh, day uh, the jabra tws that i was testing also got an update uh, by the time you see this video i might have posted the review of this one on my main channel geeky randy and also the G dj action 2 has also got an update so i'll also update this one and the footage that you'll see from the dj action 2 would be after the ota update so guys uh, i have updated the dji there was a ota update mera uh, ko i didn't have any problems but anyways updated it by the way the sd card i purchased a micro sd card 64 gb uh, but it always gives a warning that it is slow it might stop recording but it's recording uh, but if you guys want i'll leave the link of that one don't buy that it's a it was a popular sandus card if i remember so don't buy that you might need to have a higher uh, uh what do you say speeds one but uh, we did record we did test it worked but why take a risk anyways so uh yeah today is like friday morning and finally after like so many days it was raining like crazy hyderabad or whatever in fact there was a chill two weeks ago it had stopped it had become pretty warm in the morning but now that slight chill has come i am enjoying it because uh, while you wear this riding gear and jacket everything oh my god it's like a sweater and you know hyderabad can get pretty hot so i just don't enjoy driving if it becomes a little bit hot i don't know how will i drive in summer <laughs> maybe 5:30 5, 5, 5 o'clock nikalna padega rides ke liye god knows uh so we are uh, going to go towards financial district first and this is an open area of the road and recently on this road the cops have added so many cameras for example as you can see here is a camera every place you will see cameras and they have placed this 30 km speed limit on this open road and trust me guys abhi 20 25 days pehle hi laga hai and so many people are getting chalans left and right hyderabad see again cameras here and here uh here like uh, people are getting chanans left and right and people are like really angry uh, in our society i think so dozens and dozens, dozens of people got chanans and here the, the speeding chanan and this road is really op open i don't know and here uh, this area especially the high tech city oh my god it has so many camera so you get those automated chanans 
Yeah, you'll just get a SMS after some time. You are chalant for thousand rupees, twelve hundred rupees, or whatever. Some more camera. And this takes your photograph of your number plate, etc., and says you were speeding. Ah, uh, anyway, so that's a red. Here we have to. Oh, it's green. Oh, lucky we are because here we have to wait. Otherwise, two minutes. I'll blow the horn, people. Still, after all these cameras, break a signal over here. I don't know why. Ah, we're gonna miss that signal. No problem. We will wait. Uh, the bike has been performing well. Now I'm liking it a little bit more. Uh, as I said in my main review on the Geeky Ranjit channel, the only thing, as I've told you, it'll become red. I knew that you have to race basically to get it. So we'll just wait there here and we will then continue and uh, guys uh, today it is so crazy the helmet was fogging a little bit i don't have the pin lock on uh, this uh, this is an empty helmet uh, so i have to get that in fact uh, one uh, negative thing about this empty helmet though it is very comfortable i tried a lot this was the most comfortable on my head uh, getting the accessories of this one is a little bit different uh, because about uh, last week I went to the helmet shop from where I went and they source almost all helmets I asked for an extra visor just to be on the safe side we'll take a right here and also the pin lock uh, but uh, that was simply not available for this empty helmet he told that uh, we might get it after like three weeks so that is something about empty helmets the accessories and stuff uh, uh, got to be careful if you are buying this one other brands of helmet uh, smk axor i don't think so you have that much of a problem just wanted to be clarify you about this one and this is the wipro office guys wipro circle also they used to call this this is the wipro office it's huge inside the campus uh, the only thing as uh, the main uh, slight nitpicking that i had with this bike was the long gearing but now i've ridden over thousand kilometers I'm sort of getting used to the long gearing uh, but I think so that is the only nitpick uh, that a normal user might have with this bike to be frank even the suspension is sort of okay again speed cameras I've told you this area is like full of speed cameras it's like a maze uh, well I know I would name uh, this is a youtuber friend uh, he was coming from Bangalore to Hyderabad and he had no idea about these speed cameras he came from the Bangalore to Hyderabad and once he entered Hyderabad Pugarar area and this high-tech area he got chaland for seven times seven times within uh, that one and a half hours and it was like each chalan speeding is about 1200 rupees so 9000 or something so yes if you're coming to this area beware if you think the road is empty and you'll whack your throttle okay you're ready for a find so yeah in fact uh, when i got my bmw uh, on the bmw the thing is that you just cross 80 you don't even come to realize that's the problem with these high powered cars yes it gives a beep but you don't notice and initially when i got it in the first month only i got two speeding fines okay so yeah and uh, I think the speed limit on that road was 100. I went 108 or something like that. It gives even a photo with your speed, so you can't dispute with them. So, so these days I'm like really careful. And uh, most of the modern cars uh, actually do that constant beeping at 120 kmph. But I think so. The most of the speed limits in India are like 100 now. So they should manufacturers should give an option of start beeping, user option, not mandatory to start beeping at 100 it would uh, help a lot people to avoid the fines uh, so guys this is actually the ORR road uh, we are just exiting the ORR road in fact uh, directly on the ORR road two wheelers like this or even three wheelers that auto rickshaw etc is not allowed but uh, this is sort of the exit we are exiting to the high tech city uh, Gachipali sorry not high tech city Gachipali area so that's just beside uh, so here bikes and stuff can uh, go so yeah so this is a beautiful road yeah like come on this is an exit as you can imagine imagine the main road man oh man it's so beautiful and hardly uh, hardly about 25 percent of the vehicles that you're seeing will be there on that so, oh man it's such a bliss driving uh, on that road i just sometimes like i just go out on that road to enjoy the drive so, beautiful roads beautiful and th no potholes or anything like that so you don't have to worry about it 
beautiful roads but again yeah it's a toll road so you have to pay the toll and stuff and uh, speed limit is 100 on the orr road for the last two lanes uh, on this lane i think so it was 80 only a long long time ago if i remember it was 120 again that's in my head correct me if i was wrong and because of that once i got a fine on bmw i thought uh, long back about two years ago the speed limit is 120 and i had kept the limiter on the bmw to 118 and i was driving at that speed got a fine so yeah you realize the fines uh, the speed limits <laughs> after you get the fines so it's 7 42 am i like uh, having a clock uh, in the dash it's just so convenient every bike should have that it's just so convenient so that way I like uh, the this is a very practical bike in terms of the odometer the only thing I miss uh, it doesn't have a rpm meter but again for this kind of a bike I don't think so uh, you have rpm meter but yeah that is something I missed but I think so 99% of the people will not care about that I still have to get the ECU update done on this bike Another small thing that uh, swayed to uh, swayed uh, to this highness to me, and I know this might be silly, but this one actually had a slipper clutch, and uh, I'm so used to engine braking. I let's say if that car is there at front, I will. I generally never use brakes directly. I downshift very aggressively, and uh, if you are into that habit having a slipper clutch helps you a lot otherwise there can be wheel locks uh, so it's sort of a safety feature i know again 95 percent of the people will not care or simply might not use that feature but yeah i like it's there because again i use engine braking quite a bit and we're going to take a left turn here this is just around the care of uh, what is a hospital and I have liked what they have done they have done this recently this is called Kajigoda road this is a new road they did uh, I don't know what six months ago or something God knows right, uh, but fairly a new road I don't recall exactly so let's take I'm, I'm giving hand signals also because yeah man, just got to be a little bit safe again camera I'll see because these new roads people ah, ha, ha, love to and this is a road that begs you to drive fast glad they have cameras because people will do otherwise stupid things i like this road man what they have done and some of the new parts of hyderabad uh, at least this uh, uh, what do you say telangana government uh, uh, is what uh, is doing a good job i would say pretty neat man like gives a very good vibe uh, like liking this road there's a small lake over here i think that they call it the kajigura lake yeah, yeah, as you can see, I always see people vlogging here and uh, doing that Instagram uh, stuff a lot here. Every time I go, people do it. People come for chalk. I think so we are late. Otherwise, we would have seen a lot more too. But just look at the view, man. Like, beautiful. So, yeah, thumbs up to the government, uh, Telangana government um, and uh, our, what do you say, um, minister at least, yeah some of the areas okay i don't know this right area this is supposed to go to the orr i have never explored it so let's just go there and say i think orr obviously it's not allowed but i just wanted to get an idea where this road leads maybe once i come in a car to this area maybe maybe just uh, i'll know this route that's what i do on the bike i just explore roads go here and there so if you get stuck also no, no road is there you can revert back and come car sometimes the lanes get so narrow you just get stuck oh man oh nice sir oh, i didn't expect okay so i'm already exploring some parts of hyderabad with you guys but again that's the uh, financial district etc area and all those things too many buildings man too many buildings again i think so the whole of new developer new big buildings uh, there's going to be even a 58 floor uh, building going to come supposed to be the biggest in that area all coming this side only so here okay finally the road ends as expected it's not done <laughs> so okay apparently this will lead to it will connect somehow to the orr road it seems okay whatever cool so let's head back uh, but anyways at least you have it i feel uh, 
these uh, whatever gadgets cameras whatever accessories are a simple tool to get your job done and if a particular tool is able to get your job done thoroughly that's a good tool and i, I review so many i review i i'm fortunate to test out so many devices and stuff what i have realized over the years is that xyz product might have 15 or 20 features that it uh, says on the box but it might not do all of them or majority of them well but there might be another product okay might be similar priced or whatever it might just advertise five features but it does those five features damn well and for me for a professional i would say who for whom getting the job done is right it's not just a casual stuff i think so that matters so these days i am looking at products i would say i i don't get swayed like a kid okay you have 20 different features oh this is better no 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 in practical usage day to day which one works and how well it works is important i would say so just want to head back again this is the slight traffic that we are seeing in fact this traffic i feel will increase drastically in the next couple of weeks because a lot of uh, alti companies they haven't made uh, uh, what do you say coming back to office mandatory yet it's sort of optional but they might do it in the future if uh, the third wave does not come uh, so yeah that's regarding and uh, what do you say equipment uh, I would say youngsters, many of the youngsters get swayed by the specs, I would say, See, seeing just the specs, the actual quality does not matter. I wish these bikes for some reason get that auto, what do you say, turn indicator cut off, whatever, because many times I, I am also guilty of that, I forget it sometimes. So maybe a timer if somebody like, okay, switches it on after like he doesn't close it after 30 seconds automatically i don't know this is the geek in my mind thinking too much i guess but anyways guys uh so heading back so we will end this uh, video here again let me know what do you feel about this one and if you have any specific questions let me know uh we'll do some chit chat in morning uh what do you say uh, drives like this yeah okay by the way about the uh, what do you say uh what was that my cousin's uh, car forgetting this is kodaku shack okay um, he is free only on what do you say saturday so hopefully on saturday morning i'll try to shoot with him and if possible i will try to post that video on sunday let's see how it goes so anyways guys that's it for now thank you and catch you later and if you are still not subscribed to this this is my new channel subscribe take care catch you later guys bye